Waking up to a lot going on in the Atlantic. I'm meteorologist Joe Hansel. Two main weather features that we're keeping an eye on for your predicted severe weather threats. Waking up this Sunday morning, wildfires out west. Thousands of firefighters continue to risk their lives combating what could be some of the largest wildfires in some states or maybe some uh, regions' histories. And also watching for uh, Laura and Marco. You may have uh, read some hyperbole, very clickbait weather stories, megastorm. Yeah, stuff like that. Do your best to disregard it, but also at the same time, whatever forecast info you get, hold them accountable. Be skeptical, even myself. Uh, it's uh, very healthy to be informed, but also not confused. So know where you get your weather information. Uh, infrared satellite imagery of Marco. Once again, in the purple shades on this kind of imagery, deep thunderstorm development. It's a strong tropical storm. Max sustained winds at 70 miles per hour, moving north northwest, diving into the Gulf of Mexico as we speak. Folks at the National Hurricane Center, some of the smartest minds on hurricane uh, forecasting, forecasting a hurricane next one to two days or less. So hurricane warnings are already out in coastal areas of southeast Louisiana. Uh, Tropical Storm Laura, earliest L storm on record. That's been the trend for this Atlantic hurricane season. Currently over Haiti and the Dominican Republic, likely some heavier torrential rain. Flash flooding, a concern for Hispaniola. That'll work across Cuba. Dive into the Gulf of Mexico about a day later. It could become a strong hurricane, could impact Louisiana. That sounds familiar. Kind of overlaying both at the same time as well, one after another. They won't really combine per se or what you're thinking, but they will interact. Ever watch the movie Ghostbusters? Someone's crossing the streams right here. Out west again, air quality alerts including Denver, excessive heat warning in Phoenix, multiple wildfires in the southwest United States. This is what thousands of firefighters are combating. So many people lost their homes or are evacuating, watching for dry thunderstorms with a lot of lightning and also severe weather in the upper Midwest, New England, coastal areas of Louisiana be weather aware today and plenty of heat.